going to call it control uh, um, it's going to be let's just call it control with a small c that's the object this first is just the uh, uh, the class that's the data type and the second one is the object good now this method notice i'm making it i'm breaking it down into two different methods from this method we're going to call this method five times each time we're going to pass so for the first time we're going to call it we're going to pass the text box one then we're going to call it and pass button one we're going to call it and pass button two i hope that makes sense anyway uh this is where we're going to do our real uh calculations so uh we're going to say um control dot location or sorry for that we need to calculate the uh the positions first the new x is equal to um is equal to control control uh sorry not control um so resize control x ratio y ratio ah okay i'm beginning to think we probably don't need to pass x ratio and y ratio we can actually calculate x ratio and y ratio um while we're doing this so uh yes we also do not need to pass in x ratio and y ratio we can actually calculate it while we're doing it uh, inside here so the thing that is most important when we're passing is the original control uh, size so we're going to need to pass a rectangle and pass the original control sorry control uh, rect and then pass the control so this is the original control rect which we're going to pass one of these things either text box one original rect button one or anyway please i don't want to call i know i'm always confusing myself uh talk less of you so please let's just try and finish the code and probably i will try and explain and i'll also try and explain why i kept deleting a lot of code so int new x is going to be equal to um we're going to uh, calculate the ratio. Um, so the ratio, uh, I said we're going to calculate the ratio, so we need to do that now. Float x ratio is equal to this, that's the form, dot, um, dot width divided by uh original that's form original size original size dot width now it is absolutely necessary for you to change these things to floating point to float data types if you do not do that that is if you don't cast them out to float you're going to have division of two integers which is going to give you back another integer so please remember you're going to make this float as this dot width is going to be casted to float and form original size that width is going to be casted to float so this is how you're going to cast it to float you just put float in brackets before you put this dot width in brackets also put float in bracket before you put form original size dot width in bracket so i hope that is clear <laughs> okay that is just for x ratio we're going to do the same thing for y ratio float y ratio is equal to going to cast that to float um this dot sorry dot height 
divided by floats and form original size dot height okay so we we have uh, calculated our x ratio and our, and our y ratio next thing we need to do is we need to uh, calculate the new x of this particular control I hope this makes sense this uh, method is going to be responsible for calculating for each and every single control I don't know if that makes sense it calculates for a particular control that we pass that's a text box one or a button one and then inside here we're going to make we're going to call this five times each time we're calling this we're passing the correct control that we want to resize okay i'm just going to say that and assume you understand so new x is going is, is equal to control dot uh location location dot x uh multiplied remember that's a capital x multiplied by x ratio oh yes since uh new x is an int this is a float we have to cast again to int so remember this please whenever you are converting from float to int you cast also when you're converting from int to float you cast so we cast that to int new x equals uh control dot x multiple we're going to do that the same for new new y is equal to int uh, control dot location remember this we're just doing it for the uh, for the location of the control times y ratio excellent okay next we need to calculate for the width and the height so we're going to do uh, int new width is equal to also we're going to cast to int or it's going to be control dot location uh, sorry sorry not dot location control dot size dot width multiplied by x ratio and then for int new height is going to be remember to cast it to an int uh, control dot size dot height multiplied by y ratio okay um that's it the next thing we need to do we have gotten all the four remember i said we're going to change four uh, components of each uh, control notice these are the calculations so the we've, we've calculated them and we've stored them inside new x new y new width and new height so all that is left now is just to set the uh, the, the correct uh, data so we're going to say control dot uh, width uh, sorry control dot location is equal to new uh we're going to put um okay a location takes a point so we're going to put new point and then inside we're going to pass the new x and the new y i'm just hoping this makes sense finally the next thing uh we need to set after the location of the control is the what size of the control control dot size is equal to new size we're going to pass uh, the new width new width and then the new height okay excellent believe it or not that is most of in fact that's all the calculation we're going to do so the remaining things that that's left is just to uh, 
uh, how do we say we'll finish the mathematics the rest is just 